ministry project of Christodio Ginogaga from passages taken from the Holy Scriptures with quotations from the Spirit of Prophecy by Ellen G. White. Daily Daily Abiding in Jesus Christ. July 15, 2020 1 Thessalonians 5 verses 1 to 6 But of the times and the seasons, brethren, ye have no need that I write unto you. For yourselves know perfectly that the day of the Lord so cometh as a thief in the night. For when they shall say, Peace and safety, then sudden destruction cometh upon them as travail upon a woman with child, and they shall not escape. But yet, brethren, are not in darkness, that that day should overtake you as a thief. Ye are all the children of light, and the children of the day, we are not of the night, nor of darkness. Therefore let us not sleep, as do others, but let us watch and be sober. Quotation from the Spirit of Prophecy There are in the world today many who close their eyes to the evidences that Christ has given to warn men of his coming. They seek to quiet all apprehension, while at the same time the signs of the end are rapidly fulfilling. Paul teaches that it is sinful to be indifferent to the signs which are to precede the second coming of Christ. Those guilty of this neglect he calls children of the night and of darkness. By Ellen White, Acts of the Apostles, page 260. Our prayer for you today. Our Father in heaven, with ultimate humility we approach your presence with awe and reverence because you are most holy, just, good and you are our loving Father. It is our prayer that in spite of the unpredictability of the second coming of Jesus Christ, help us Father that all of us who are here seeking for your blessings to make us ready for the return of our dear Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Amen.